Hi Sagittarius, this is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and I'm using a new deck. You can look at the review, I've made it, uh, the Star Tarot by Kathy McClelland Mac and I hope I say it right. And it's a beautiful deck, it's the second edition and it's really vibrant as you can see. And thank you very much for your loyalty, your likes and shares, and a welcome to the new viewers. Please subscribe and hit the bell on all, and make sure that you set your settings in YouTube and your mobile device, so that you can be notified when new videos are loaded up or when I go live. The first card that you have is the Queen of Swords. The Queen of Swords is Libra, but don't exclude Gemini or Aquarius. You might be meeting somebody like that, a person, an air sign, particularly Libra, or you might be taking a page out of their book as they have their emotions under control. They are caring and they are nurturing, but they um, uh, are communicators and they know the letter of the law or they have a very high intelligence because the card stands for learning the judicial system institutions uh, also means um, communication um, you m usually see Gemini's or Libra or Aquarians being authors presenters uh, teachers uh, butchers surgeons uh, advocates, lawyers, social workers, all that type of career or vocation. So you might be seeking legal advice from one of them, but they will cut straight through to the core and seek the truth as um, they also stand for clarity and truth. And they will cut straight through to the core on your behalf and they will do the research and get the right wisdom or knowledge so to protect you or guide you. So this could be also a teacher um, that is a Gemini that could be advising you or a legal advisor. Then we go to the Emperor and that will confirm that this could be a lawyer and the Emperor represents Aries and he's a, mm, he is the head of a lot of countries. He's got a higher status than the king. He knows how to delegate. He also knows the letter of the law and uh, he also represents institutions or municipalities. A lot of people don't know what municipalities means but that is government institutions. Okay, so you could be definitely seeking advice from a professional if not uh, it could be a father figure or a person, a mature person that you respect. If you are in a judicial situation, you will have victory. Why? I will come to that in a minute. But on Wednesday, you and remember, time is man made, so victory can be yours in the beginning of the week due to this guidance and seeking the truth and cutting straight through to the core, getting down to business. There are celebrations. You've got the Three of Cups. Somebody could be coming back from the past and giving you information that will bring clarity with regards to a judicial situation or a question that you have. As you've got the Six of Cups, you might be reminiscing about the past, okay? But somebody could be coming back from the past and giving you a gift and that could be the information. You've also got the Six of Swords. You're moving away from arguments from rough waters to quieter waters. You might be moving home. You might even be going on holiday. Wow! You could be crossing water. Even if it is just traveling from home to work. In some countries you have bridges 
that cover water. So that is going across water. It doesn't have to be the sea, it can be a lake, it can be a canal. So you are traveling. So you could be traveling for water or traveling to your advisor. And it could be with regards to money or material issues, like a house. And in, yeah, no, it's not a tent, so it wouldn't be an inheritance. It could be about money. It could be about promotion. It could be about uh, a job that you've applied for, and you have the nine of pentacles. So you are going into a new phase, an ending to financial difficulties or material difficulties, something that it's tangible, that you can touch. So you might get a promotion, you might uh, get a gift, you might even inherit. Or, or um, because we've got the castle in the back, you might uh, be selling your house after uh, a long time being on the market and you might be buying a bigger house. Now you have the money. And the Nine of Pentacles is the more or less the same for me personally as the Nine of Cups. Who doesn't want money? And that is a wish coming true. Now I said that you are celebrating and that the energy could be throughout the week and not specifically uh, one day or another day as you have the ace of swords that means victory recognition new study you might start a new study which will bring in its rediment more money perhaps you're starting an internment ship and that is your promotion you have victory you could also be starting a new communication with somebody from the past. Boom! There you go. The truth is out. If you're in a judicial situation, you will have what you deserve and somebody else will, or the other person will get what they deserve. Karma will come back threefold. Believe you me. You've, the world is your oyster. You hold the world in your hands something is coming full circle you're in a transformational period you're going into a new face like i said it's also lying next door to the six of swords moving home or going on holiday that is exactly what the world means as well you might even go up a, a notch or a step in work or in romance if you're going out you might be getting engaged if you are working, you might get a promotion. Awesome. Victory is yours. You know where you are going. Now, carry on is your TLC. Tender loving care for your soul. Carry on. You're on the right path. Or you're going in the right, you're going with the flow because it's water, not the path looks a bit like a windy road. Keep following the course you've set for yourself and if the divine wants to change your route you will be you will of course be given notice just when you need it. Never in advance. Make a plan. Take a breath and remind yourself isn't it wonderful? Everything is out of my control. There is more happening here than what I can see. A cosmic plan is playing out right before your eyes mind. Your mind's eye, sorry. Listen as the exquisite beloved whispers. Yours, uh, your efforts will be duly rewarded. Carry on pouring love into your innovations. Wow, that is really bringing you back into your strength and grounding you. Brilliant. Inspiration, self-esteem, believe in yourself, spread your wings and fly. Well, that is what you're going to do. You've got victory and you're having celebrations. Good on you, Sagittarius. You deserve it. Take care, my darlings, and thank you so much for the thumbs up and sharing with family and friends. Love you dearly. Stay safe and be blessed.
Ciao, ciao.